I will teach you the tics, tips and tricks now. Let's go for the amazing tricks. This is your first trick, the brushes from Dialux effect. For example, here, you can see the, the one I mentioned to you. This amazing app lighter here is a brush. So if I go to the brush, I can select that brush from, oh, where's my brush here? Brush, brush, brush. Okay, I cannot see my brush here now. So let's create this brush again. So what are you going to do is uh, go to your Dialux or Dialux Evo. Let's delete this one for now. And for example, I want an app lighter. For example, I'll go to the torn fittings again and select one app lighter. Go to the recess and then go to the effect. And I will select one um, high powered LED with, uh, for example, 920 lumen output, 8 degrees, and yeah. And I will use this one, and then I will select it, and then I will see it here now. So go to the plan view, and insert this one app light, and then make sure you offset it maybe 20 centi away or 30 centi away from your wall, and then run a calculation. Just look at this one. Okay, so this one is so powerful. I don't like this one. It's so powerful. I need more. Let's have, um, what is the degree? Let's have uh, 28 degrees. Okay. And then I will use it. And then I will replace this one with a little white beam. Say yes. And then I will run it. Say okay. Okay, uh, this one is still powerful. Okay, let's make our a wall 20 meters high and um, 20 meters width because I need to capture all those lights. That's why I'm making like this. I will tell you why I need to capture the lights. Okay, so let's imagine it's enough. Okay, let's find this one. And then go to your uh, rotation and then make it flat like this and then save the image save as export and then save this image as and make it JPEG let's go to the desktop and say apply we will make this um, IS file okay let's turn up first file export image and then apply this is the original effect from Dialux, so we will use this one in our um, in our Photoshop. So go to the desktop, open this uh, image, open with Photoshop. Uh, where is my Photoshop? Okay, then say okay. And once you open it, it will pop up here. And then you can crop it, crop, 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 up to the edge of the wall. You don't need to, okay, if you want to copy the the light luminary, you can also do it, but um, no, you don't need to do that. Go to the edge of the wall, and then crop, and then control L, make sure it's totally black and white. It will, it should distinguish the black and white, like this. Okay, fine, this is fine. And now you have your, um, um, up lighter. This is the original effect from the Dialux Evo. So go to the filter uh, image and then adjustment and then invert. Now you inverted it. Okay, let's unlock it first. And then go to the um, brush, sorry, file and then where's my brush? Def uh, sorry, edit and then define brush uh, preset. It means you are defining this uh, black, black object that you're looking at now as a brush. So yes, and then you will name it as an app light. Say OK. Now it is now an app light. Now you can see it now in your brush. So go to the brush tab and you can see here now it's 984. The code of this brush is 984. And for example, I go and make this uh, new layer. For example, I will add a new layer and I will have this um, canvas, I'll go to the brush, 
brush and look at this one. So, ta-da! Now, and if you want to make it smaller, press shift uh, bracket, sorry, plus, I'm uh, sorry. Oh, wrong. Um, press the bracket, not shift, just the bracket. And then press, 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 and then, okay, L see what happened. I am I'm trying to create a brush, but I'm in the wrong layer. That's why you cannot see it. Even if I brush, 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 you cannot see it because I'm, I'm in the wrong layer. That's why I, it is really important that you must work in the correct layer. Like in Dialux Evo, remember the site, the building, you should be in the correct layer to, to do that uh, command. So I'll go to the correct layer now, layer one, and then I will do my brushing. See? See this brush now is a correct brush from the IS file. That's why I got this effect. Because this is the correct, um, I will zoom it. Because this is the correct uh, brush from our fitting. Then for example, I want to use this brush here in, oops, in uh, this file. So see now I have this kind of brush. For example, I want to put a effect here on the wall. So I'll just do like that. So this is the correct effect from Dialux Evo. Okay, this is one of the tips and tricks. So you can use that uh, IS file uh, or the photometric file from Dialux file in Photoshop. It's possible. For example, you want a linear. For example, another one. Let's go to the linear. Change it with the linear. Say okay. And then, uh, all right, let's rotate it properly. And like this. Let's run it. Oh. Where is it? Uh, okay, sorry. Orientation, let's make it 180 degrees to make it up. Then move it a little here. And then let's go and run it. Alright, so this is the effect of this linear. So we can use this same brush, uh, sorry, this same photometric as a brush in our uh, Photoshop design. Okay, but make sure it's a, it is off, offsetted properly in the wall because see, there's a, a ugly patches here. All right, questions, questions? Okay, <laughs> no questions. So next, um, 